In a previous video, we discussed this idea of how do you draw a graph, does it matter? It turns out that there is a way to describe this mathematically correctly. This is what we call isomorphism. This is a common definition in lots of areas of mathematics, it turns out. In graph theory, it means that two graphs are isomorphic if they are the same except for how you drew it or how you labeled it. So I'll do two, some examples of this because this is a little strange. The following two graphs are considered the same. So we have this graph, and I'm going to label these vertices as A, B, C, and D. If I draw another graph over here that looks like A, B, C, D, A being connected to B, B being connected to C, C being connected to D, D is also connected to B. And now these graphs are the same. I just drew them differently. They have the exact same vertices and the exact same edges. They just have been drawn differently. Let's move this over and explain how we can do this even more, where the three graphs we're going to have on the screen are all going to be the same. So I'm going to have a graph on the right that looks like this. I'm going to label these as V1, V2, V3, and V4. And I'm going to have V1 connected to V2, V2 connected to V3, V3 connected to V4, and V2 connected to V4 as well. And you might say those don't look the same. However, if I were to cleverly relabel these things, and I relabeled them as, in red, A, B, C, and D, now it actually kind of looks similar. And if I were to real or check all of the edges, there's an edge between A and B, there's an edge between B and C, there's an edge between C and D, and there's an edge between B and D. Those are actually identical graphs. They're just drawn and labeled differently. The, the important properties of graphs all hold regardless of how you draw it or how you happen to label the vertices. We haven't really dealt with this yet. We kind of just pretended like the graphs we drew were the same. And it turns out that they are. It doesn't matter they use squares and called them V1, 2, 3, and 4, or A, B, and C, and D, or edges cross or don't cross. All that matters is if you can relabel it exactly, then it's the same graph.